What is up guys, Luis Obanda from Blue Media here and in today's video we are going to learn how to install fonts or custom fonts from the internet onto your computer and so that you can use them for whatever you may need them whether it's for designing the decal or designing a t-shirt we're going to teach you real quick the website I use the most and how it is that I download, install and what softwares you kind of need to do this super easy process and it should be a very very short video and if you have any questions like always please please uh, comment below or send me a message and we'll get the answer for you is we're gonna open up a chrome web browser i am already on the website that i use the website is called thefont.com dafont.com and here you'll find a very very large selection of fonts I will kind of show you how to navigate to the website a little bit and then also I'm going to show you how you can preview these fonts without having to download them to your computer because that can get very very annoying very tedious and at the end of the day you will have tons of fonts that you might not even ever use again or on the home page here and on the home page you have a I guess a a section called recently added fonts it's just the newest ones that they've added and we're going to use these fonts for an example if you look over here on the right side above the download the big download button you can see a couple options and the option above this one is demo demo is usually a font that the author creates and they put it on the font so that people can try it for free but they do expect some type of compensation in the future now in the same section right here you have the download button if of course you want to download the font if you click on the donate to author button it will take you straight to their PayPal where you can donate a certain amount of money um, some of them have a set amount some you can just donate whatever you like the next uh, type of I guess license I'm going to show you is this next one right here and it says free for personal use and so that just kind of like you can use it for yourself if you're gonna make a t-shirt for yourself a decal for yourself um, and you're just good to go to use that now you can't use this to create logos and stuff like that but that's not what we're here for we're here to make decals and we're here to make t-shirts for example Bagotu, Bagotu it says 100% free over here on the right it has two fonts and it's free to download and you see on these 100% free fonts it doesn't even have a donate to the author button and that's because they're pretty much authorizing anybody to download these fonts to use them for whatever they like so I always try to find the 100% free fonts uh, at least that's my recommendation you can use I mean whatever you want but whatever legality issues you get into that's kind of totally up to you just a little disclaimer um, so uh, Luis how how is it that you test these, each font and you know without having to download each one so we're gonna go ahead and click on one mm -hmm. click on this requires moonshine font and so in here you will have the title of the font you have pretty much a whole alphabet I guess how it looks before having to download it that's pretty cool pretty common in all these but the feature we want is right here it says custom preview and what we'll do is just type in text I'm gonna type in little media and we're gonna click submit and so what that, that does, it pretty much gives you a preview of how that font looks with whatever you're trying to type in it. And it's just a really good feature. So let's go ahead and download it. And click download. And so when a font downloads, you're gonna, it's going to be in what's called a zip folder. So what I'm going to do is click this little arrow on the right side and I'm going to click show in folder. After you click show in folder, you, got, you can do two things. You right click and you can extract all if you have Windows 10 which has the built in ex extract uh, or unzip file or you can use 7-zip which I have installed on my computer and it's pretty much the same thing extract here or extract all so we're going to go ahead and select this and extract and so here we go we got the font right here now there's different ways to install a font you can you can right click kind of like what I'm doing right now and install super easy so we're gonna go ahead and do it and do pull up the little loading bar and it's voila installed you can also 
go into your control panel in the appearance and personalization folder you will find fonts so you can click that folder open and bam the folder will be open and what you could do is you can literally grab drag and drop and it'll install as well um, I'm gonna go ahead and open up Photoshop so that we can see that our font is installed and ready to go Alright, okay, so I have Photoshop opened up and we are gonna go ahead and grab the type text tool make a layer real quick and we're gonna go ahead and select the font requires moonshine and there it is so once you do that we're gonna go ahead and type in a little media I have obviously a green color selected and there it is guys I mean super super easy nothing to it uh, I might have rambled off a little bit more than I had to but uh, there it is a super easy process guys again if you like the video please leave a thumbs up and if you really like my content please subscribe turn the little notifications on so that you can see my future videos on how to run your decal and t-shirt business catch you guys in the next video thank you so much for watching adios